Hey everyone, happy October 1st and I'm really excited to share with you guys my process video for my October daily cover. So to get started, I'm just applying some Mod Podge on top of my journal that I'm going to be using. And I used the 12x12 paper pad by Pebbles and it's the Boo Collection. And it's this one that has a bunch of words on it like pumpkins, skeletons, a bunch of Halloween words. So I really liked it. So I used that as my main background. And now I'm just using my Memento ink to ink the edges of my journal. I really love the distressed look that it gives so yeah that's what I'm doing here. The paper bag that I'm using is from the After Dark Collection by Crate Paper. So I just put that on top of my background. And the paper I'm using now is the Give Thanks Collection and it is by American Crafts. The washi tape that I'm using is from Walmart and it's their 97 cent washi that they have right now. I just taped that on the bottom and I cut one of the ends to look like a banner. The ephemera Polaroid picture thing, I don't know what it's called, I got from the After Dark ephemera pack by Crate Paper. And the journaling card is from Pebbles and it's the cut apart sheet, so, cut apart sheet, so I chose this one to put on top. The second washi tape that I'm using is from American Crafts and I picked this up at Tuesday morning so I don't know if it's like an older collection or a newer collection. So that's what I chose to add another layer and now I'm just adding some foam stickers on the back to make this pop out a little more. Most of the ephemera pack is from the After Dark collection, so I used this little skeleton and I put that on the side and as well as that little, I don't know what that's called but um, it is from the After Dark collection as well. I'm really excited to be doing October Daily this month. It is the first year that I'm doing it, so I know it's going to be a lot of fun and I can't wait to see what October has in stores. The alphabet chipboard stickers that I'm using is from the Target Dollar Spot and I used that just to put October and later on in the video I do use some Tim Holtz stickers and it's these little font ones and I use that to just spell out daily. Lastly, I do use these sticker bats and they're from the Target spot as well. So I just stick those three on and I do end up using some dilutions just to add some splatter to my pages and that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys like this process video and I'll see you in my next video. Thanks for watching everyone.